All right, guys. I found some more hidden treasures in the hills. I just got it, and this is this is actually the same cliff that I was on the other day, just in a different location. Uh, I came back to snoop around some more, and <clears throat> I found something up in here that I got to go and check out. But this is going to be a very... I have... This is going to be crazy. But I'm going to try to work my way up in there. <clears throat> and, um... Go up this... <clears throat> go up this creek bed as far as I can. Yeah, I got to go up this creek bed as far as I can <clears throat> and then work my way over. But this looks like another nice waterfall. One up above again. Bunch of waterfalls in this area. But this is pretty uh, treacherous walking. So once I get up where I got to go, uh, I'll click and show you what I found. But I seen something definitely up in here that I gotta go and see and see what it is. I'm glad I came back to this area. And uh, I know it had something to do with the mines because that's the only thing it could be. But I really can't tell what it is until I get up there. So I'll see you at the top. More cliffs. Look at that nice waterfall. Man. Definitely got to come back after heavy rains. Because these waterfalls would be awesome. But. Alright. I got to go up this. Wow. This is. uh Wow. Like I said before, what do I get myself into? Well, that's what adventure is all about, right, guys? And exploring. You never work, never know where it's going to take you, where it's going to lead you, or what you're going to find. Look, there's actually a rope. So somebody made the same... Somebody made this climb before. They put a rope there to help them. I'm going to need two hands. So, wow, look at that big falls up there. Again, after a heavy rain, wow, that would be nice. All right, I'm going to need two hands here. See you at the top. All right, so I just made it up the rope part. And then I cut down here. But, uh, look at that falls up there. So, I gotta keep on a shimmying. Alright. I'm up off of the... This... Well, I'm not off of the steep stuff yet, the cliff, but I'm still on it. But it's a little, little easier walking here right now at the moment. I think I'm getting closer. I think I'm getting closer to what I've seen. from way down, from way down there. <clears throat> wow. Look at that rock face. That's really cool. 
I'm winded. Again. Hmm. All right. I think I'm getting closer. Find out here pretty soon. All right. I'm actually right up against this massive rock formation. It's kind of hard to walk because my feet keep slipping because like I said, I'm on a really steep cliff. So it's kind of hard walking and all this stuff, it's like really, really loose. So <clears throat> it makes for tough walking. I know, I know I'm getting close to what I seen up through the trees. There it is, from down on the bottom. There it is. It's a big, looks like a big cement thing and there's a big tube. That's a mine. I knew it had probably something to do with the mines just because this area was nothing but mines. In its back in its heyday. I mean, this was cool, rich. Ooh, I just slid. Good thing there was something to grab there, or I would have kept going. Go ahead, you guys can laugh. It's okay. Wow. Yeah, I mean, this is definitely. Whoa. And there I go. <clears throat> Sorry for the grunting, guys, but this is... Something's been traveling this rock wall. Using it as a bathroom. Oh, my gosh. This is insane. But being that this was all mine rich, and these mountains was nothing but mine tunnels and whatever. I know this had to do with something with the mines. I just don't know what, if you know what, like, look at that. You can see the big, the, it's like a big metal, like a barrel type thing. I don't know if that would, I don't know if that's like a, a tunnel that goes in through there and goes down over the mountain. I don't know. If anybody knows, you can drop it in the comments, but. My job is to find the stuff. So if anybody knows what the stuff is I find, if there's a name, or, like, I don't know if this was a... Yeah, check it out, man. It goes into the hillside right there. And then it comes down underground here. Wow, is this hard to walk on. But look. Check it out. I wish I could get on the, the bottom side of this. And then it comes up here. It comes up. And then it goes into that rock wall and probably into the ground. So definitely something to do with the mines that's crazy man I don't know if that was like a some uh, somewhere like if it was a ventilation duct or if it was somewhere where they shipped the coal out of the mountains and sent it down through this barrel thing underground and down into there and down by the river to or down by where the tracks used to be and loaded or or what but this is cool 
I want to try to get down. I'm going to try to work my way down on the lower half of it without killing myself. So I'll catch you when I get down there. Nice view. All right, so I'm down a little bit lower. But you can see it came from the top and it just runs down. And then it just keeps going and then down to where the tracks used to be, where there used to be railroad tracks. This is definitely uh <clears throat> wow old mine mining ruins oh there we go yeah see it just keeps going it just keeps on going and then that used to be railroad tracks right there and then right there's the river It's hard to get to, I tell you that. So I don't know if this was just a place where from wherever they was working underground up there or whatever in this mountain, if they just shot the coal down through this thing or whatever they was mining for and just fed it down through to wherever they was loading it or or what what whatever. I don't know what this is, so if anybody knows what you call this or what would this would be, I would appreciate it if you uh, left it in the comments. But um, like I said, I'm not too hip on this this stuff, like knowing the names and stuff for it or whatever. I just like going out and stumbling upon stuff, exploring, finding stuff, and whatever. But here's a good here's a good um, good view of it here. <clears throat> Again, guys, I don't mean to be grunting and groaning, but like this is really steep and it's hard to navigate. And you get winded really easy. Yeah, but see, check it out. I don't know, man. That's pretty neat. My and it goes right into the mountainside up there. But my guess it's whatever they was mining for here, probably cool. But um that was the method that they used to shoot it down the mountain, down to where the trains, the train was or whatever they loaded it. But you can see it just goes right into this and then right into the mountain, right into the side of the mountain. <coughs> it's hard to say, it could run the whole ways down here and go underneath where the train tracks was. Who knows, it could, who knows where I went? I don't know. But this is really cool. Yeah, I was just down there. I thought I would come back and look for some more stuff in this area. And uh, I was down there and I seen it. I seen this and a little piece of this. So right away I knew I was climbing this. <laughs> and I was coming up here. I don't see nothing else over that way. Looks like it gets pretty thick once you get over in there a little ways, but. Yeah, so, pretty wild, man. And I'm working my way back, back down off the mountain now. Cliff, and, and I'm in a, I think I got myself in a little bit of a, a little bit of a bind here. This looks pretty. Uh, now I'm going to have to empty out my shoes. i got about a half pound of dirt. Wow. What the heck? Well, there's no easy way. I mean, there's no easy way up there. 
and there's no easy way back down. You just got to go for it. Brace yourself and go for it. You can't little you can't let little obstacles stop you when you're on adventures. You just got to go. Sometimes it's a little bit too impossible and too dangerous like that house I did the other day. But Wow, man, I'm in the jungle. Welcome to the jungle. But I see daylight at the end. As long as there's nothing hidden in here that latch onto my ankles. All right. All right. All right, guys. Wow, that's what I was just up on. <sighs> up there is where I just was. And somewhere here is where that pipe goes underground and comes down. But I, it's obvious that it goes underground. Like, so I'm thinking it actually goes under this trail. I mean, who knows, it could go under, it could be way underground to go underneath the river and to the other side. I don't know. But somewhere, like you can actually see it right up there, that's where it was. Way up, up there. And that thing, you can see it, it runs down through here. But there's nothing <coughs> down here. So I think it runs underneath the... It runs underneath. There's an old mine tunnel. There's the tunnel. Wow, well, can you feel the cold air flying out of there? Actually feels good. Pretty cool. guys so I really didn't see I know there's other stuff up in there I just couldn't see it from here from where I'm walking so I could get up in there like the the other big place I could see it but I can't I know there's other stuff up in there probably but like I said to walk on that is almost impossible just to go up there and just spend a day walking on a cliff looking for stuff so I thought maybe I'd be able to spot some more stuff but um I didn't maybe someday I will go up and just walk it just 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 to see because I know there's probably other stuff up in there but <clears throat> oh well that was that's the end of this little adventure i hope you enjoy seeing that and uh i'm gonna end this little video here and i will catch you on the next one <laughs>